second assumption, which is that Donald Trump does not win the election, and that uh, Hillary Clinton does. Uh, our, our finding is, is even to have to think about that prospect. Thank you very much. Yes. Mr. President, you mentioned Russia. Let's talk about some serious issues that have come up in the last week that you have had to deal with as President of the United States. Okay. You mentioned the vessel, the spy vessel off the coast of the United States. Not good. The greatest thing I could do is shoot that ship that's 30 miles offshore right out of the water. Everyone in this country is going to say, oh, it's so great. That's not great. That's not great. Russian spy ship that's been prowling off the East Coast, traveling as far north as Connecticut, and at times coming extremely close to entering U.S. territorial water. They're there. The first time since the Cold War, multinational troops will continuously rotate through four countries in Eastern Europe. The troops are for war, isn't it? We need to make the Russians pay a price. By killing, killing Russians? Yes. Hillary Clinton did a reset, remember, with the stupid plastic button that made us all look like a bunch of jerks? He looked at her like, what the hell is she doing with that cheap plastic button? We worked hard to get the right Russian word. Do you think you, we got it? You got it wrong. I got it wrong. <laughs> <laughs> you say that the Jewish accusations of Russia has the Democratic Party emails. Well, I don't want to use all that words. <laughs> Experts are telling us that uh, Russian state actors broke into the DNC, stole these emails. The Russian hackers have. Russian hackers are the prime suspects. Russian hackers. A Russian hack. Russian government hacked your email? Yes, that's what I believe. The United States formally charged that Russia organized the hacking of democratic political sites and state election systems. The United States will treat cyber attacks just like any other attack. You probably heard about the rise of fake news. Mm -hmm. You want to talk about fake news? Everyone is pissed off at the fake news. You are fake news, sir. You are fake news. I'm not giving you a question. Right on. I'm changing it from fake news, though. You're Very fine. fake news. Though. I know, but aren't you? Well, Hillary Clinton has blamed fake news on her loss. It's now clear that so-called fake news can have real-world consequences. Accused, along with myself, my brother, and others, of running a child sex ring out of the pizza parlor. I still have some questions about but that, by the way. <laughs> Entered the uh, Comet Pizza uh, with, a, with an assault rifle. I'm ready to die for Trump at this point. He knows that some, there's something hinky about 9-11. You will find out who really knocked down the World Trade Center. Donald Trump, he's saying, elect me and I will expose 9-11. This is Donald Trump, 33 years old. And some people think that he wants to buy the World Trade Center. Who is that? Is that the mayor that showed up? <laughs> that Rudy? Oh, Rudy got up here. Another great man. He gave us nothing when we needed a life-saving radio. His company, Bio One, made millions of dollars off of the 2001 anthrax attacks. Never. Impossible. That's what firefighters should remember about Rudy Giuliani. I don't give a shit what they found. It is not true. America! Get to the whole truth. What was the tr Trump Russia connection? Russian intelligence compiled a dossier on Mr. Trump during visits to Moscow. Ex British spy claims Trump is a Russian stew. And it claims that he paid prostitutes to urinate on the bed. Caught on a Moscow hotel room surveillance camera. I did give Donald Trump a golden shower. Here it is. It's all fake news, it's phony stuff. It didn't happen. That's something that Nazi Germany would have done and did do. I think it's a disgrace. They may go ahead and kill him. I mean, you need to pray for Donald Trump right now, folks. I feel like we are in the kind of Alice in Wonderland period. At this moment of um, a certain amount of confusion and doubt. I'm a Republican. I voted for every Republican uh, since I was 18 years old. Trump is a different kind of animal. Including Mr. Trump? No, not oh. including Mr. Trump. He's the first, like, didn't, I couldn't vote for. Uh, who represents a different kind of threat uh, than, than the politicians that we have seen in the past. I'm having a hard time remembering exactly. Um, 
so much has happened.